Hello my wonderful people, welcome back to the news. You see, the controversy between Atiku Abubakar and President Bolad Mertinibu over this Chicago State University certificate of a thing is really, really getting messier and more tougher. More tougher in the sense that uh, people have started, you know, people are believing that there was a forgery. I mean, Tinibu forged the certificate he presented to INEC. And others also believe that Tinibu did not forge his certificate. So the end point of this is that um, Tinibu is yet to react to this, his Chicago State University saga that has generated a lot of controversy online. Tinibu is yet to react to these things. But then my country people, in a recent development, President Bola admit Tinibu has made his first public appearance since the recent revelations regarding his certificate from the Chicago State University in the United States. Politics Nigeria reports that Chicago State University had distanced itself from the certificate President Bolad Metinibu is currently parading in Nigeria. The institution, however, agreed that President Bolad Metinibu attended and graduated from the school. And in a tweet by his official ex handle on Monday, President Tinibu said he remains focused on his mandate to move the country forward. I guess um, Tinibu is still focused on, you know, hitting the ground running, running the country because Tinibu has already hit the ground. So he's still running, you know, and doesn't want this article's uh, certificate saga to stop him from running and from doing the work he has promised Nigerians that he would do, most especially the renewed hope agenda that he promised Nigerians. Well, the institution agreed that Tinibu had attended its uh, school, you know, but uh, he attended and graduated from the school, but they had alleged that the certificate he's holding is actually a forged certificate. Moving forward, we received a briefing from the SGF Akumi at the State House this morning that all hands must be on deck in the great tax of positioning our great nation for progress, the president tweeted. Meanwhile, the former vice president, Atiku Abubakar, has sought the permission of the Supreme Court to file a fresh forgery evidence against President Bola Admet Tinibu. And that is the fate of President Tinibu, whom many have seen that, oh, this man really forged his you know, certificate. So my country people, what are your thoughts on this? You know, this Chicago State University saga has really gone on and on and on. But Atiku Abubakar is just pushing on this to see if he can actually get something out of it. But Tinibu is now letting this issue to weigh him down. And has declared that he would still fulfill the promise he made to Nigerians. I mean, he has promised Nigerians a lot, infrastructure, development, security, this and that. But some are yet to see those promises being made by the president, while others have already said the president is good to go and has really done a lot since he emerged as the president of this nation. However, Nigerians have reacted to this. How about the young girl that faked jam results? She said her original result, she she has her original results, but chose to fake jam results. We must not allow tribalism to cloud our sense of judgment. Go home and tell your father, your uncle, or mentor that he's a criminal. He must repent and he must repent and be set free. He is a hardened criminal, an ex convict and a drug baron. We, sh- we shall have a person with the said certificate forgery and can still move the country forward. This kind of, um, we don't welcome it to, but with a forged certificate, you do not have the integrity to attract partners and investors with whom you will move the nation forward. Well, this man did not have the honor to address the momentarily embarrassing allegations made against him. He he obviously takes Nigeria for granted 
as the president can get away with any crime. And what mandate is he talking about? Is he Ganduji's mandate? He talks about moving Nigeria forward. How? Is it true his lying? Is it true his deceit? His silence on the allegations of this kind of offense? Or what can it really be? Okay, guys, these are reactions from Nigerians. So, my country people, Tinibu don't generally watch Hankomo for anything we consign this Chicago State University matter. As he be say, Atiku Abubaka won't carry this matter for head. Fine, making the carry him. But it's obvious that Tinibu is quite not interested and has not given tangible reactions to all this saga, at least to explain himself on these issues that Atiku are bringing up. You know, to actually prove Atiku wrong. But Tinibu has kept mute. And this has left many Nigerians wondering. Is it that what Atiku is saying is the truth? What is uh, President Bola admit Tinibu really hiding from the people? That he doesn't want to share, you know, with Nigerians. So my country people, I'm dropping here. Kindly share your thoughts on this in the comments section. Thank you.